The Documents function enables you to easily track the right to work status of your employees. When the Right to Work feature is enabled, a new Right to Work document category is created in which you can store documents you've collected as evidence of employees' right to work. The Right to Work options are added to the Employee Profile page, enabling you to upload Right to Work documentation. The Right to Work report is added to the Custom Reports section, and two new recipes are added to send automatic notifications before and after an employee's Right to Work documentation expires. To enable the Right to Work feature, select Settings. From the left-hand menu, choose Employee Data, then select Documents. Scroll down and select the Track Employee's Right to Work Status checkbox, then click Save. As you can see, the new Right to Work document category is created automatically. When you now go into an employee profile, you have the option to upload documents as evidence of the employee's right to work. This option is only available to administrators. After you select the document to upload, you can enter an optional description. The right to work document category is selected for you, and your name will appear as the company user. Right to Work documentation is only visible to the employee's direct managers and system administrators. Select the document type and optionally add a document number. Then, indicate if the document expires and if so, when. Predefined recipes will send automatic notifications to the employee's manager 90 days before this date and on this date. You can edit these recipes as needed to meet your company's requirements. As with all other documents, you can select the Ask to Accept the Document checkbox to generate a task for the employee to review and accept the document, and notify employee by email to send a notification email that the document is available. When you're ready, click Upload. You can view edit or delete a Right to Work document directly from the Employee Profile or from the Documents tab. When the Right to Work feature is enabled, you can run a report to view the Right to Work status of each of your employees. Click the Reports tab, then choose Employee Data and select Custom Reports. Click the Play button to run the Right to Work report which shows general information for each employee, along with their right to work status, any documentation that has been uploaded to support this, and when it expires. From the Custom Reports page, you can also export the report data to a Microsoft Excel workbook, edit the report to customize the information it includes, or delete it. Finally, let's look at the two new recipes that help your organization proactively manage the right to work status of your employees. Select Settings, and from the left hand menu, choose Recipes. By default, the Email Reminder Right to Work Expiring Soon recipe sends an email to an employee's direct manager 90 days before their right to work documentation expires and the email reminder Right to Work Expired recipe sends a second notification when the documentation expires. You can edit these recipes as needed to meet your company's requirements.